Hello friends, welcome to channel of Think Glasses. Friends, you might have noticed that today I have folded my hands in front of you. There is reason behind this. Friends, we are learning English language. It doesn't mean that we have to forget our own mother tongue or we have to disrespect or show disrespect to our own mother tongue and towards our culture. Because whatever problem right now we people are facing or the whole world is facing, there is reason behind this. Most of people they have become so called modern and that's why they have started shaking hands which now we realize that how dangerous it can be because as now Modi ji has started saying and we also realize that social distancing is must and folding hands and to maintain distance physically it has been taught since beginning in our culture. So friends though we are learning English language but two things we have to remember. First, we have not to forget about our culture which has been inculcated in our mind and in our brain and which is running in our blood too. And second thing that we have to fold our hands and we have not to show disrespect towards our own language. And as far as today class is concerned, friends, as I have already written that today whatever I will teach, I will teach you about Saturday assumption. Many people they consider Saturday as um, in different different way people talk about many lines about Saturday but if we talk about um, uh, western culture so in foreign countries people are not bothered about any day any particular day may, I am not saying that they are wrong or we are right but yes maybe that in our culture some because we always believe in planets we always believe in our horoscope we always believe in our astrology and many things we believe in and which slowly whole world also understands and they have started gaining or paying attention towards this but if we talk about our own indian culture so we will find that there are so many myths related to saturday so we will discuss today about all those myths about all those sentences about all those assumption which are related to this particular day because these lines these things are discussed and talked only in India not in abroad because as I have already told that if you live in abroad so for you Sunday Monday Tuesday and these all the days will be same because they have their own almanac they have their own style to live but because we people are Indian and we are called so much civilized and really we believe that whatever has been taught to us it is the best thing and slowly gradually people have started accepting this thing today and one normal example to fold our hands and to maintain somewhat social distancing because mm -hmm. in village we always see that people they since beginning they start a kind of they believe or they keep a kind of distance physically i mean to say but as india is becoming overpopulated country and so people have started forgetting and they are that much busy that they have forgotten whatever has been taught i will not say that it is their mistake but i will say that as the walk of life people they change themselves and somewhat culture also gets changed but slowly when we re start realizing or now since we have realized so let us see that how many people they think about some assumptions some myths some sentences which are particularly related to this day it means saturday well friends we will start with this and as already it is written saturday say related sentences so now i would write that saturday say related six sentences there may be friends so many other sentences but okay because all can't be taught in one session or in one class so i have taken those important sentences which we use especially for saturday well friends let's start so our first sentence is that normally mother says or when we check our nails so we always get confused and first of all it is our indian uh, culture or it is our mentality first we think when we start trimming our nails so first we think about day and if it is thursday so of course we will avoid if it is saturday so we avoid so i have taken that sentence from this thing that shani ko nakho nahi kaatte this is in passive voice why i have written because this is felt by each and every one in India and especially mother, especially our elders, they always say that ये शनिवार को नाखून नहीं काटते। So okay friends, how to speak this line in English? Let's see. As it is written that nails are not trimmed on Saturday. Friends, I would repeat this line. शनिवार को नाखून नहीं काटते। It means nails 
आर नॉट ट्रिम्ड ट्रिम मीन्स काट छाट को उसको ठीक करना काटना छाटना सो नेल्स आर नॉट ट्रिम्ड ऑन सैटरडे सो इन दिस सेंटेंस ट्रिम दिस इज योर की वर्ड यू कैन मेक सो मेनी अदर सेंटेंसेज दैट ओके डोंट ट्रिम योर नेल्स बिकॉज इट इज सैटरडे और इट इज थर्सडे वेल फ्रेंड्स वी विल मूव टू अनदर सेंटेंस भगवान शनि को सरसों का तेल और तिल चढ़ाया जाता है एज एवरी वन नोज दैट लॉर्ड शनि और हाँ एज वी से दैट लॉर्ड शनि इज कंसिडर्ड समॉट शॉर्ट टेम्पर्ड एंड वी ऑलवेज ट्राई टू प्लीज हिम सो इन दिस केस वी कैन टेक भगवान शनि को सरसों का तेल और तिल चढ़ाया जाता है सो वी विल एज आई हैव टोल्ड दैट वॉट एवर सेंटेंसेज आई हैव रिटर्न टूडे दीज ऑल आर एजम्पन एंड मिथ और मे बी इट इज बिलीफ ऑफ सो मेनी पर्सन दैट वाई आई हैव नॉट रिटर्न सब्जेक्ट आई हैव रिटर्न इट डायरेक्ट इन पैसे वाइज सो भगवान शनि को सरसों का तेल और तिल चढ़ाया जाता है हमारे द्वारा सो मस्टर्ड ऑयल एंड सीसेमी इट इज कॉल्ड सीसेमी इट मीन्स तिल मस्टर्ड ऑयल ऑलरेडी एवरी वन नोज सरसों का तेल मस्टर्ड ऑयल एंड सीसेमी इज ऑफर्ड टू लॉर्ड शन आई होप यू माइट बी गेटिंग मस्टर्ड ऑयल एंड सीसेमी इज ऑफर्ड टू लॉर्ड शन ओके नाउ वी विल टॉक अबाउट थर्ड नंबर सेंटेंस लाइक लोहा खरीदना शनिवार को अशुभ माना जाता है लोहा खरीदना शनिवार को अशुभ माना जाता है एंड वेन वी गो टू परचेज एनी थिंग विच आर मेड ऑफ आयरन फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल एवरी वन वेदर पुअर रिच और सोकॉल्ड मॉडर्न और अ काइंड ऑफ कंजर्वेटिव पर्सन बट एवरी वन ट्राइज टू अवॉइड परचेजिंग आयरन ऑन सैटरडे सो दैट्स आई हैव टेकन दिस सेंटेंस लाइक लोहा खरीदना शनिवार को अशुभ माना जाता है सो इट इज कंसिडर्ड इन ऑस्पिशियस फ्रेंड्स This is in auspicious. This is your keyword. Keyword means अशुभ It is in auspicious is your keyword and in auspicious means अशुभ So it is considered and considered in the sense of माना जाता है As I have already told that these all the sentences I have taken in passive voice because everyone believes this. So it is considered in auspicious to purchase iron on Saturday. It is considered इन ऑस्पिशियस टू परचेज आयरन ऑन सैटरडे एंड फ्रेंड्स आई वुड सजेस्ट दैट इफ योर पेरेंट्स दे आर फॉरबिडिंग यू टू परचेज आयरन ऑन सैटरडे सो प्लीज फॉलो आई एम नॉट सेंग दैट इट इज कंजर्वेटिव थिंकिंग बट वॉट एवर अवर पेरेंट्स दे से सो दे आर इज ए काइंड ऑफ अवर सेल्फ इंटरेस्ट दे आर मीन्स दे ऑलवेज वॉन्ट अवर बेटरमेंट दैट्स वाई दे फॉरबिड फॉर समथिंग सो वी हैव टू फॉलो देम ओके नाउ सेंटेंस नंबर फोर शनिवार को पीपल के पेड़ के नीचे दिया जलाया जाता है एंड मोस्ट ऑफ लेडीज दे डू सो जेंट्स ऑल्सो आई पर्सनली डू सो बिकॉज वी ऑल आर समवट रिलीजियस नो डाउट एवरी वन वेदर वी शो और वी डू पंप एंड शो और वी रिमेंबर गॉड बाय हार्ट बट एवरी वन बिलीव और एवरी वन डज समथिंग लाइक दिस सो शनिवार को पीपल के पेड़ के नीचे दिया जलाया जाता है एन अर्थिन लैम्प इज लिट As friends, I have already told that every sentence is taken uh, means as a passive voice. So lit, as you know, light means jalana, light, and it is lit. Word it is third form. So an earthen lamp, an earthen lamp. It means dia. Earthen lamp means dia, or an I have taken because we are talking about singular. So an earthen lamp is lit. Lit means jalaya jata hai, prakashit kiya jata hai. Under the peepal tree on Saturday, an earthen lamp is lit under the peepal tree on Saturday. Okay, now we will talk about next sentence. शनिवार को काले कपड़े पहने जाते हैं This again, it is an assumption or myth, or maybe people they believe. Okay, so we can't refute their belief. Okay, so we will only uh, translate those lines in English. So शनिवार को काले कपड़े पहने जाते हैं Black dress is put on on Saturday, friends. Here I would draw your attention. Here it is written put on. Put on means पहनना. Put on means पहनना. Jewelry पहनना, चप्पल पहनना, कपड़े पहनना. So put on it is again pressure verbs. One or two days before I have taught you idiom and pressure. So you can understand put it is verb and on it is preposition. So when we combine, so it makes another meaning that is called पहनना. 
so black dress is put on on saturday on i have written here because when we talk about day or um, date so we always use on before day or date as a preposition we use on that's why i have not written here so that you can't be confused so put on it means pahanna and one again on saturday it means saturday go well friends now we will talk about last sentence which is not the least tum par sanichar sawar hai this is generally spoken when mother gets irritated or anyone like if grandmother gets irritated so anyone may say that tum par to sanichar sawar hai so we can translate that you have been possessed by an evil evil spirit you have been possessed by an evil spirit friends you have been possessed possessed means you can take it as an example of bhoot chad jana also so you have been possessed by an evil spirit friends when we watch any bollywood horror movie so we find such kind of thing that this girl has been possessed so this sentence has been taken from there like tum par to sanichar sawar hai it means you have been possessed by an evil spirit friends for this sentence i will suggest you that many uh, people or many teachers they might translate it in different way also i would not deny that their sentences are absolutely wrong and only my sentences are correct because a translation can be formed in one or two way so we can't say that another teacher is teaching wrong and only i am teaching correct if you find such kind of any other sentence so you can also understand that okay so you have been possessed by an evil spirit well friends these are the six sentences related to uh, saturday like first and i would repeat it so that if anyone or any of you has any confusion so you can uh, understand like shanivar ko nakhun nahi karte nails are not trimmed on saturday bhagwan shani ko sarso ka tel aur til chadhaya jata hai mustard oil and sesame is offered to lord shani this is your keyword and here this one is your keyword loha kharidna shanivar ko ashubh mana jata hai it is considered inauspicious to purchase iron on saturday then shanivar ko pipal ke ped ke niche diya jalaya jata hai an earthen lamp is lit under the pipal tree on saturday again you can see that saturday it is name of day so i have written here on an earthen lamp is lit under the pipal tree on saturday एंड फिफ्थ नंबर शनिवार को काले कपड़े पहने जाते हैं ब्लैक ड्रेस इज पुट ऑन ऑन सैटरडे हियर पुट ऑन हैज अनदर मीनिंग इट मींस पहनना एंड ऑन सैटरडे इट मींस सैटरडे को नेक्स्ट एंड लास्ट तुम पर शनिचर सवार है लाइक यू हैव बीन पजेस्ड बाय एन एविल स्पिरिट यू हैव बीन पजेस्ड बाय एन एविल स्पिरिट इट मींस बुरी आत्मा या कोई बुरा साया लाइक दैट वी कैन से well friends these were the sentences six sentences related to saturday as it was given and as i had already told that i will uh, whatever i will talk i will talk about uh, culture and which is related to especially for saturday as i have given already in my thumbnail also well friends uh, if you like agar aapko hum logo ka ye video pasand aa raha hai so please like share view and comment and do subscribe our channel friends मैं उन लोगों को सजेस्ट करना चाहती हूँ जो व्हाट्सएप पर मुझे शो कर रहे हैं अपने आंसर कि आप मेरे कमेंट बॉक्स में आंसर कीजिए जिससे मुझे बार बार व्हाट्सएप और अपने इस चैनल को बार बार उसे ओवर उसे थ्रू नहीं करना पड़े और उसे बार बार मुझे दोनों को अलग अलग नहीं देखना पड़े और इसके थ्रू ही मैं आपके आंसर्स को शॉर्ट आउट कर दूंगी वेल well, फ्रेंड्स अगर आपको ये वीडियो पसंद आ रहा है तो आप मेरे डिस्क्रिप्शन में जो लिंक दिए हुए हैं उससे आप नेक्स्ट वीडियोज भी दे सकते हैं ये बातें मैं आपको हिंदी में क्यों बतला रही हूँ जिससे कि जिसको भी थोड़ी बहुत कन्फ्यूजन हो वो उसको समझ सके और कोई भी कन्फ्यूजन हो तो हम लोग उसको आराम से शॉर्ट आउट कर सकें वेल फ्रेंड्स नाउ इफ आई मूव फ्रॉम हियर यू कैन टेक स्क्रीन शॉट्स एंड थैंक फॉर थैंक्स for hearing me okay stay home stay safe thanks friends take care